Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, man. Oh, got uh, the one here. Uh, thank you again, David. Uh, does Maven have any Chris Benoit stories? Yeah, actually, I do. Um, and I, I, <laughs> I thought I told this one, but I'll tell it again. And uh, no, going into it, like I said, I'm one of the ones that can compartmentalize um, the horrible you know the monstrosity the 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 just i mean enormously sad acts what happened to daniel and mm. his wife i can compartmentalize that i am and, and and i don't say anything about chris without leading with just what happened to to, to his family what he did is unforgivable right, but, right. so and you remember, I mean, you remember Benoit was a, he was one of those guys to be around. He was just like, he was intimidating. Like, you know, he just was even backstage. He was like, God, my, like, like, man, if he slapped my mom, I'd ask her, what'd you do to piss him off? Right. Sorry, Chris, you won't do it again. You know? Right. But, um, we went out one night, a, he pissed in a bar, like against the wall. And not in the bathroom. And I never understood like why he did it, but it did happen. I, okay. I physically saw it with my eyes. Chris stand, stood up or right by his table and just pissed against the wall and then stood sat back down. <laughs> and so he was he was gone. And then we get back to the hotel and I don't know how, but because we never me and him never rode together. You know, we were cordial and you know, we had no issues with him. And um for so whatever reason he ended up in my room. And it was the night after Raw, the, the you know, Tuesday morning flying home. And it's like, well, you know, one in the morning, I got a 6 a.m. flight. And he's in my room, passed out on the bed. And I'm just like, like scratching my head. I'm like, like, I'm not laying on the bed with him. So he wakes up at four, wondering how the hell did I get here? Right, right, right. You know? So I sat in the uncomfortable chair and, you know, with the TV at volume three. <laughs> <laughs> Hoping to not not interrupt him, and I just right. sat, waited till four a.m. So I left to take my rental car back and go to the airport. And while well, he snored the whole night, and to I'll never I forget what I forget what the circumstance was to where there's a uh, uh, Chris Benoit in his underwear laying in my in my bed, and then I'm hoping I'm like my God, I hope none of the boys come in right now. Right? Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> Imagine the locker room talk on that yeah, one. Yeah, like, yeah, like we weren't close. Right. How am I explaining that? Right, exactly. Yeah, I don't know. Right. <laughs>